So as we mentioned a couple minutes ago, there are 2 million air fryers being recalled due to faulty wires. It can cause a fire. But even if your air fryer isn't among those being recalled, there are ways that it could become a fire hazard. We're getting answers from the West Springfield Police Department, which recently responded to a fire started by that popular kitchen appliance. Certain Kasori air fryers are being recalled after more than 200 reports of them catching fire, burning, melting, overheating, and smoking. The U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission is urging people to immediately stop using the products, which have a wire connection that's prone to overheating. A recent fire in West Springfield has been linked to an air fryer. We don't know yet if it was part of the recall. Lieutenant Tony Spear tells Western Mass News the air fryer was left unattended on a stove. It was on the low setting and the uh, air fryer itself didn't shut off automatically, which contributed to the starting. He says an air fryer should only be used on the countertop and unplugged when you're not using it. One place that you don't want to keep it is on the stove because you have those burners there. So if the burners activate or if the burners kick on or they stay on, um, that could ignite the, the fryer itself or other things around it. And Lieutenant Spear says an air fryer should be treated like an oven. It should never be left unattended. Anything that creates heat is going to cook something. Um, could pose a hazard. So just make sure if you're going to use it, stay with it, stay with inside of it, and make sure you're keeping track of when it's on and off. He says smoke detectors alerted firefighters to the air fryer fire in his community, and they were able to put it out before it caused too much damage. Those Kasori air fryers were sold in stores and online between June of 2018 and December of 2022 at Best Buy, Target, and Walmart. If you think you have one, go to recall.kasori.com for a free replacement.